Hello and welcome back to this episode 13. Damn, I'm already on 13. Nice. Well, it's on 13 of my automation let's play. And if you hear a lawnmower in the background, I apologize. I don't, I can't stop that. But let me just log into my world here. And today, what I want to do is first fix some of the side of the chest and then I want to finish up my red power 2 machine my factory over here that was built previously I believe yes there it is so let me run over to it got some nice mountains over there through my huge doorway so all I have now is a battery box which is charging up very nicely so now I want to Place my sorting machine. I think it's in here. Let me see. Sorting machine. There it is. And I already got my battery box placed on. So with this, I want to put it. I want to make an input chest. Let's see. If I get one of these, I can have that there and there. And I also need a screwdriver, of course. Where is that? There we go. I want it to be facing that. There it is. And now I probably want another timer. So I'll go make that off camera because you've all seen how to make that before. Okay, we got our timer over here. And I did have to go make some more redstone from my thing over there. And I also patched this up that I let you know. And now I'm going to go back over here and place my pointer. And I actually think this, should I need torches in here? That's what I need. Let me see, do I have coal? Yes, I have coal. Uh, shit. Something like this. We do need some torches in here to get some light. Just place it along the wall. Go to sleep real quick. Just so we don't worry about that too much. Okay. Woke up real quick. Yeah, this does require energy, and I don't know what those things do, but what I want to do is actually, it's up there, I want to get my diamond drill, I want to show you something, if you get your diamond handsaw and your cobblestone, and you place those in the crafting table, you can get these things called slabs, and they're not like the slabs that you walk on, but with these you can cut those into panels, and then down into covers. So, I'm gonna make a lot of covers here. Cover, those are all covers, right? Panel, them. Okay, I just want a lot of these. And I'll f put some of this away. Oops, I accidentally left that there. Don't wanna leave that in there, or else I'll lose it forever. So now, with these, you could place them anywhere, and you could hide your wire through the wall. I'm gonna show you how to do that. So first, you just want to break all your wires. I'm going to do something like this. This is going to be cool. Uh, let me get up there. I just used all my cobblestone like a dummy. I shouldn't, have, I shouldn't have actually used quite that much. But if you run it down like this, I'll go pick up that blue wires later. If you run it something like... No, I do need more cobblestone. I think I have a lot of it. So I want to run it like this. And then down here. Wait, can I pick this up? Yay! Okay, so I can place this here. And then, so I don't have to move all this wiring. Where's all my wiring? Oh, there it is. And... So we'll place it here, down this wall. And here we can place our covers so we could put up to make the outside look like there's nothing there to be seen I don't want to do it on the top because that will mess it up but you can do it like that and you can completely cover it inside I'm gonna as the name suggests covers <laughs> but yeah so let me just get these nope I didn't want to place you so if you keep placing your first I think you want to place your wires first at all times then you want to place the covers like so. So this way you could run wires through the wall, still getting all the full effect, and you won't have to see it. So it'll be like some kind of like hidden shit. It's kind of hard to get it sometimes. There you go. Depending on your angle. 
me just yeah see you can't even tell the difference except right here you can they didn't put one of course wait there it was there it was there we go now let's just get a few more I do want it to go down here and connect yeah I think that'll connect is that working oh not you there let's see yeah it's working I saw it okay so now I just want to cover this up with our cobblestone panels that's what they're called if you didn't know there then you can cover right here and right here and here see I got energy running through the wall getting all my energy and you won't notice a difference and I think my sound from Minecraft is off it's like I think it's a glitch with the game but I'm sure it'll why am I doing this I'm sure it'll fix in a bit I do have a lot of glass so I can fix this up also and I need a cobblestone there will that work yeah I think that work and let me put my last piece of glass back and you won't notice any wiring running to the wall and my battery box is still being charged let's see yep I think so now we can run this wire through through the wall here down over here to our what you call it sorter let's see if I do this yep then we can cover this up from the outside also I should probably do this with my pneumatic tubes because it does work with those two not just wires I should probably move this chest also let me get this and there we go so now our this should be getting power yep why is the power going down what the hell oh it's going back up now that was weird I think it sucked it into here and I really have no clue what this does but I saw direwolf put it on this one I believe yeah this one so I'll just leave it there and I needed a lot of pneumatic tubes and I'll get those and I'll be back oops actually before I do that I forgot one thing I do want my timer to go down here like so and I want to grab my screwdriver and make it face this direction yep and you can see this thing being making that weird stuff and I'll patch all this up there now I'll go get my stuff okay so now the next thing we need are flax seeds and these seeds are found just like normal seeds you have to break tall grass to get those and so I'm gonna go breaking some tall grass actually nope I have a better way I'll show you that in a second aha here we go an iron sickle and no it's not used to kill zombies like in racial ops if that's what you were thinking it is used it's probably my the best mod item ever created because it does destroy tall grass and if you were listening in my one of my videos I tell you I hate tall grass it doesn't just destroy one it destroys a lot of them in the area so let me go break some I do need flax seeds which comes from tall grass so I guess I can't hate it all too much but yeah it breaks all the ones in the area in a small area so I'll just keep trying to use this let me see no no, I'm just getting normal seeds. I need black seeds. They're like brown seeds. But they grow string and they are used to make paint brushes, which is needed for my sorting machine. Nope, just some more green seeds. I do need some food. So I need my avocados. Let me eat those real quick. And I'll go back to my seed hunting. Let's see. No. No green seeds I know you can get them I know it do I have any? no and I need to grow them too good thing I have a lot of bones I think you use bone meal on them no 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 nope 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 can't find these things anywhere I'll come back to you when I find them okay I have not found any seeds and it is getting dark but I did find this nice little tree here and I don't have an axe ship so I'll just chop it down the old-fashioned way let's see maybe a sickle works good on it 
sorry if you can't see. There. Let's see a little bit, maybe. Oh, and the game keeps freezing. Let's go get some. I'm trying to get these oranges because orange trees are as good as avocado trees, but oranges just to shake it up a little bit. Okay, let's do this. Okay, I'm gonna break this tree and I'll go back to my base and sleep and I'll be back. Okay, we're gonna plant our next fruit sapling back here and I see that big fiery thing again. Oh, two of them. wonder what they are. I really have no idea. Mm -hmm. So I wanna get this going. Let's see. Maybe right here. Yeah, looks good. Now I'm gonna go. I think maybe you can't get flax in snow biomes. So maybe I'm gonna go over here and try to find some and I'll be back. So just walking by, I wanna show you how epic this looks. And there's some stingrays or manta rays down there. That looks pretty cool. So back to my hunt for the flax seeds. Okay, I'm back, and I think the flax is broken right now. I believe you, I believe, you're, I know you're supposed to get it from breaking grass, but it's not working for some reason. And I have over two stacks of seeds now, and I think it's kind of overkilling it, and all these flowers from all the stuff I killed. So I'm going to try to find another way to get flax, and I'll think about that while I, and I'll be back. Okay, I'm back, and I do want to apologize. I do need to spawn myself in some flax seeds because that is broken, and I should have gotten flax seeds already. I really am against this, but I have to do it just for this. If I could find it. Let me see. I'm sorry about this. I don't usually use too many items, but I guess I'll have to do it. So I'll get myself two pieces of flax seeds, and I'll throw away 23 seeds just to make up for it. I'll get the third one. And I'll turn that off, and I'll and I'll never come back to it again. Sorry about that. I just paused the recording. So I really do apologize for using too many items. I usually never use it. I used to use it back in uh, what was it like 1.6? Then I stopped. But I guess I have to use it now because it is broken, and I do need these seeds a lot. So I once again I apologize for that. But if you are playing the X mod pack, I do suggest that you spawn in some flax seeds and then uninstall it right after. Or uninstall too many items because it is broken. Holy shit, already? What did I do? So, I hope you accept my apology for that. But I do need flax seeds. I'm going to go. What do you call it? Oh nice, got a lot of gold. Just throw that in there. I'm gonna go get my flex. I'm gonna go grow my flex seeds, that's what I meant to say. Okay, I do need to eat some food. Now I have to flax seeds are used to make pink hands, but I do need more I don't think I need another bucket, but I do want to get rid of a lot of stuff. So just throw this in here. Organize. Okay, so I need some bones. So you get some bone meal so I can grow these. You just do that. And I'll run out here. I'll go find a good spot and I'll be back. Hey, I was thinking, what better place to have my flax seeds than my industrial craft factory? And I do need a hoe for this, so I'll get one of those. If I just get some iron. I want an iron hoe. <laughs> no, not that kind of hoe. That's what you're thinking. Let's do something like this, and there we go. So now if we plant our flax seeds. Why can't I plant flax seeds? I thought you could plant these. Maybe it has to be. Um, maybe the soil has to get dark first. I'm clicking it. I think something's broken with the flax seeds. They are not growing. What the hell just happened? This is really weird. What the fuck? What is filling up? Why is this not planting? Maybe I need one. What the fuck? There we go. Oh, it has to be planted in the dark one. Okay. Okay, that's nice. So, I just keep... Go. Break, grow, 
break, break, plant, grow, break, plant, grow, break. I see a lot of flax seeds because I do need a lot. Let's plant these over. I thought it was broken right there again. I can't plant it there. Oh, there's a torch. That's why. Okay, let's see. Grow. Yeah, and it also gives you a lot of string too. So, yeah, it's nice. So I'll just leave those planted, and I do think I got enough flax seeds now. Probably want to make a, a chest over here. Let's see. Let's craft that real quick. Okay. Now, I already have a chest in there. Let's just make my storage chest. Oops. Keep messing things up. So, I'll throw those in there. And I'm going to look at the recipe for flax seeds because honestly, I forgot. <laughs> so, let me go look up that. Okay, so it looks like I need a paint can and two pieces of flax. No, no, that's not it. To make the paint can. How do you make the paint can? Oh, there we go. I need tin plates, and I forgot how these are made. But I think it has something to do with tin and copper and, and um, alloy furnace. So let me get that out. I did bring my alloy furnace into here because I was going to use it. And let me look up the recipe for the, for the, what do you call it, the tin plates, and I'll be back. Okay, so I need tin and iron. Is what I found out. So I need a lot of iron and some tin. I need two iron for every tin, so this will be good. I'll just cook that up. Some coal. And that is almost charged, and this is almost charged. So now, I probably want to replace this with cobblestone, actually. I want my pneumatic tubes. Where are they? Ah, uh, shit. There they are. I apologize for cussing, but I, well, that's what happens when I play games. I do usually cuss. I probably want to run this through the floor, actually. Because remember I said pneumatic tubes can go through the floor. Just like the, the wires that are hidden over there. So if I do something like this. Like that. And for this, you can cover that up if you go to the crafting bench, which I should move over here actually. And I do have a philosopher's stone, so I don't really need it. But I'll have it there just for looks. My little red power 2 setup. If you. I believe it's like this. Yay! Get some hollow cobblestone covers. And these can go on here, but it lets the pneumatic tube go through it. So that's pretty cool. So I do want this to go to my alchemical chest, which I will have over here. No, where should I put those? Yeah, I should put those over here. I'm going to pretend these are my alchemical chest. What should I use? Clay? Might as well. These are my alchemical chest, and I'll put some signs on those in a second. Now with this, this the when you ch pick a color on this, Whatever color this is painted, you need some. You need your flax seeds and your tin plates to make. Here, let me just do this first. If you do something like this, you get these things called paint cans. I think I have enough for one more. Yep. So four paint cans, and with that you can get any color dye. Let's see. Uh, what do I have for dye? Let me check if I have something. Doesn't look like it. Oh, an alchemical chest. Sweet, I can make my first actual chest over here. There. Nice. So, if we get a dye, hold on, I'll get some dye and I'll be back. Okay, all I could get is the red and yellow dye, but I'll get more later. That's all I need for now. I don't need that much. So, I'll just bring this over here. I got the red and the yellow. So, yellow, red. I don't think I need that much actually, but to craft your paint, you want to get one, of, I need more seeds. Where's all my flax seeds? Didn't I get like a lot? Okay, what's going on here? Oh, there they are. Very smart. So if you get your two seeds, and your paint can, and dye, any order in the crafting table, it doesn't matter. It'll give you a red paint, and I'll do that with yellow. Nope, don't need two of those, you need one. 
into seeds. It's gonna be yellow. Let me enter out my inventory real quick. I'll be back. Okay. And also, I'll make a orange one. To make orange, if you didn't know, it's part of the actual normal game. You just get red and yellow, just like you would with a paintbrush, and mix, and you get orange. So if you do something like this, you'll get orange. And I do want a white one, but you need bone meal for that. And I thought I had some. Yes. Okay, I'll make one more. Just the white. So I have four different colors. Next, what you want to do is grab four pieces of wool. Actually, I only have enough for three now, so I'll just make that. If you put those like this, you'll get these paint brushes. Oh, they can stack good. So if you put one of these paint brushes with any color, you'll get your red paint brush. Or you could do orange paint brush. I'll get one of these. And then I want a red paint brush, of course, and a yellow paint brush. Don't want that in there. So I have three paint brushes. Now this is what's gonna help us with our sorting system. If we break through the the flooring here, it's about to be nighttime again, so I'm gonna have to fix that. If you go like this, something like this, and what I want to do is actually cover this up on both sides like this. So just to be neat. And I'm going to stick my pneumatic tubes in there. These are going to be chests in the future, so don't worry about that. And if I do something like this. Now, if I get my red paintbrush, let's say, and put it there. Is that connecting to my chest? Let me see. Yep. Then I'll connect the rest of this with pneumatic tubes, which I have plenty of. And I stick in the sorter. I stick some, say, say that wood goes to orange. Now when I put in my piece of wood, it's going to suck it out. And you see it has like a little orange bar on it. That's going to send it straight over to the orange chest, which is over here. And I'll make it daytime so you can see more clear. But yeah, it's going to go and... Oh wait, no, this is red. Whoops. I was supposed to be red. I'm smart. But let's say this one's orange. Why can't I paint it? What the hell? That was weird. Why didn't it work? There we go. That was a little glitch, I guess. I'll wake up real quick. Okay, now I pick dirt to be in red. So now when I throw in my dirt into here, it should sort all my dirt into that system. It'll only put one at a time because I did put one in here. But eventually, it will just go into here. And what I do want to do, actually, is I do have a timer here, I think. Oops, I broke my timer. Didn't expect that to happen. Let's see. Oh, it's facing the right way. I just want to make that a little faster. So it does send it out a lot faster if you do that. Maybe I'll just make it a little not so fast. Let me get half a second. There. And that will sort all my dirt into here. No, no, what happened? Why is it not working? That is a texture bug, I guess. Now it's some of it's going into here, but what the hell? It's supposed to be red only. Maybe I'm doing something wrong. Maybe this is configured wrong. This is red, right? Okay, I don't, what's up with this? Maybe if I make it orange? Let's see. Take out this orange one. Now let's try it. Hmm, I don't know what I've been doing wrong. Let's see. Why is it going here? I think maybe it has to do with these. Probably have to remove them. So I paint this one red. There. They should separate. 
Let me see. Maybe it's because of these. I'm not. I don't think I should have those. There. That'll be better. I do want to paint this one white, just to or whatever color I had yellow. And I'll take this one off just for now. Now that those are all different colors, I think it should sort them. Let me see. Now I think it should be working. Let's see. Just wait for it for a second. And it seems that... Yeah, now it's working. It was... You can't put these in the middle, I guess. But you could do that. So I can expand this all along the wall and have my machine sort all my items for me so I don't have to get disorganized a lot. Oops, that shouldn't go there. Hmm, maybe that is a bug where you can't put the on the pneumatic tubes. Let's see, so let me fill this back in real quick. Like so. I believe you can put them on the top of these. So that should work. And all their dirt will end up here. Now, let's see. Let me throw that back in just to make sure it works again. And I'll let that do its job. I'm gonna run back here and get something real quick and I'll be back. Holy fucking shit. 43 gold. Now, I did get a comment saying that your world will get boring because you have so many diamonds. But. I don't believe that because I do need a lot of diamonds for what I'm making, all the stuff I need to make, such as all the dark matter tools and, and whatnot. So I do need a lot of iron, so that's not gonna make my world boring. Or diamonds, I mean, why did I say iron? This one seems to not be working anymore. Why is that? I wanna get my call to stone just in case. There we go. I think I fixed it. I don't know why I did that. Hmm, that's weird. Maybe it's like a once in a lifetime chance of doing that. Nope, no more gold. We got a bit of iron though. So, I'm gonna go deposit this up and I'll be back. Hmm, I actually do need a lot more Mobius fuel, so I am gonna take my block of diamond, which is very expensive to, to have, and I'm gonna convert that into Mobius fuel just. Let's cover all my diamond in the Mobius field, just to see how much I can get. Okay, so if I throw my Mobius field, that's about 6. And if I throw my block of diamond, that's way higher. So I should get a lot of Mobius field out of this. But I should clean up my inventory a bit. So I'll throw all this stuff in here, as I don't really need it quite right now. And I'll press C. This might be a dumb move, but it's okay for now. I do need a lot of this. Eh, it wasn't too much. And this will make me more blocks of diamond, so I don't want to be worried about this too much. Yep, it's about to make another one right now. And what about this? Almost there. Getting getting there. And this is refilling more and more. And nothing has dumped in here yet. Nope. So, let's see what's happening. I just let that go. Yep, making all my stuff. Okay, I'll be back. Okay, now I'm going to make five more alchemical chests, just so you know, and I'll, I'll do that. You've probably seen it before, so I don't want to do it in front of you, so I'll be back. Aha, now we got our fifth alchemical chest. And I do want to make a few signs. <laughs> I keep forgetting to do stuff, but I'll do that right now. Let me just... I'll do it on the way over here. Okay, so now that we got our alchemical chest, I'm going to go here. Okay, so I made all my signs. So this one's going to be... Dirt, comma, sand, comma, sandstone. <laughs> Let's put a question mark. Okay, now, see, it replaced my sign except inventory tweaks. Now I want the next one to be rare ores, comma, Diamond. My phone is vibrating again. Damn it. Remove this. And this one can be equivalent. 
x change and what what else can I put with the code and exchange and build craft I think I'll do build craft is there a way to go back a, a line besides having to do this let me see and build craft items item next one is gonna be let's go red tower to industrial shit Industrial craft two two items. Okay, that looks good. Hmm. Now we want to target all our items. So in here, let's see, that's yellow, okay. So next thing we're gonna do is make a yellow one. Yellow. And we're gonna put all our covalence dust. An alchemical chest because I will want one of those. Um, yeah, I'll just do that. I'll just throw these in here and it'll sort it for me back to my chest. Yep. Oh, I actually do, did want that freaking alchemical chest that it took. Yeah, I should land in here in any second now. Yep, there it goes. It's only gonna land in here, nowhere else. I did want that though. Okay, so for red power and industrial craft 2, that is gonna, in the future, I'll make it black. Let's just do black. Just to be prepared. Um, black, black, there it is. And here I want my that and hollow covers. And I do want, I'm gonna, there's gonna be a lot of red power 2 things. But I'll just do this for now because I don't need all of it now. Let's see, what other items can I do from Red Power? Mmm, paint buckets, no, dyes, no, covers, I already put that. I can do industrial craft stuff like resin and rubber and a tree tap and I don't know, I'll just throw some stuff in there. So I'll make another black line just to mix it up. I think I could have went backwards. Yeah, there we go. Uh, there there and there that yeah, looks good so that'll sort all my items from there into there i'll just throw that all in right now because i do need to get rid of a lot of this just throw that all in there you go and hmm. so next what i want to do is make see the white here i want to change that Wait, no, I do. Do I have a white paint bucket or a paintbrush? Wait, don't I have a paint bucket that's white? Yeah, I do. And I do want another paintbrush that's white because I do need that. Let's see. Okay, I'll make that real quick and I'll be back. Okay, we got our white paintbrush and that's going to be our other items. So that's going to go here. And I do want pneumatic tubes. I said pneumatic, it's pneumatic. And one right there. So, then I probably want to cover this, but I throw all my stuff in here. Where is it? Where did I send it to? Oh shit, it's going to be all laying on the floor because I didn't actually specify which one it was to go to. Is it over here? What the hell, where is it? Okay, something's up. Oh, there they are. Uh, shit. Black. What the hell's black? I don't have black. Alright, it's gonna fill my inventory. I'll be back when. Okay, I fixed that little problem. Sort of. Let's throw some more stuff in here. That's from Red Power. And now, the next thing I wanna do is make an extra chest. Uh, I'll probably want it to go to the orange chest. Let's see. Orange chest. I'll do that. Orange. So now what I'm going to do is make a new item from Buildcraft, the additional pipes mod, and this is the teleport pipe, and I'll get those materials and I'll be back. Okay, so I believe I have all the materials. So the first thing we're going to do is get some sticks like this, get some wooden gears, get some cobblestone gears, get some iron gears, 
get some golden gears. And you can see already how expensive this item is. And then finally, using our eight diamonds, we need two diamond gears. And I also need glass, which I forgot. Shit, where is it? There we go. Oh yeah, I have tons of glass in my alchemical chest. Forgot about that. So now if I put glass between two diamond gears, we'll get teleport pipes. And these are awesome. So now let's see. Wooden pipe. I need a cobblestone pipe. I think they're in here. Yep. Stone. That, that'll do. And I want... I might get a needle wood, so I'll grab that in case. So what I'm going to do is head over to my quarry and stop it real quick, because I do need it to be stopped. So let's stop the production. Now I have an e a few extra signs, so I'll probably just burn those in my, in my system over here. Just burn my signs. I do need to pump those out. And next what I'm going to do is set up my stone pipe so it transfers items through my teleport pipe to frequency what should I do? just one and this would be false I don't want it to do anything yet so I think my quarry stopped actually I'm not sure yeah I probably did these are probably yep these ran out so good I do need that to be stopped so now if I go run over here I sh if I put my teleport pipe I want to switch this wooden chest with the uh, alchemical chest. Oh, what the hell? Did I just break the wire? Yeah, I did. That's weird. Shouldn't have happened. So now if I... If I put this underground, like so, and I'll change the same frequency and put re receiving true. Put my alchemical chest here. There we go. And now any items in here will get sucked out and sorted. And I do want in here to add cobblestone, because that's where I want my cobblestone to go. So let me just add cobblestone to there. Stone, and that's good. Now I should go to sleep and I'll be back. Okay, so what I'm going to do is pump out my items over frequency 1, which is my sorting machine, of course. Let's get a few pieces of wood, because I found out I can't burn signs. This should teleport all these stacks straight into my sorting machine, which should sort them automatically for me. Because that diamond, or yeah, the diamond farm was overflowing with cobblestone, so I didn't need to do this. I just let this finish. And then now, once that's done, I'm going to take out all the rest of this stuff. I'll just do that now. And I'll put gravel in there as well. Let's see. Yep, gravel. So I'll take out all this good stuff. Um... Shit, where's my alchemy bag? Right there. Just do this. Um, I get a lot of flint. Nice. Seven. And there we are. My alchemy bag is completely almost full. So that should pump the rest out. Any minute now, if I give it some more wood, actually, it will. And after that, the rest will be pumped out. The rest of my quarry will go straight into my sorting machine. And this idea I did get from Direwolf Sony, and I am going to give him credit for teaching me it, because that's where I learned it from. So I thought I'd bring it into my world. Pretty nice. This will take out a lot of cobblestone at a time, and you'll see my cobblestone chest actually overflowed. I mean this. Yeah, see? I did not put that in there last time. There. Now I'm just going to throw some more in there. I do have a lot. Let me just fill this up as much as possible. Oops. I'll leave one sort of empty. There we go. Nice. Holy shit, where are these? This, this, I swear I've killed like two of these every single episode. They're everywhere. Dude, really? You have to come out of nowhere and kill me. Oh, this is almost done. Just one more pump, and that should be good. Now I'm going to break this up chemical chest with my hand. Oops, now any item coming out of the quarry, which is not on right now, should go to frequency 
one back to my sorting machine and I'm getting a bunch of gold because of all the cobblestone income and I'll fill up my engines and I'll be back okay fill these up with some nice fuel over here and now my car should start running again let's see yep and you'll see all the items is digging are going straight oh, I see I got a broken sword and they're all just going straight into my sorting chest and I'll run over there to go find that actually what I do need is I do need some chunk loading blocks to make sure this is my sorting machine room is always loaded or else all my items I think they'll just disappear so I don't want that to happen so to do that just put a gold get four iron like that and we'll get a chunk loading block and I want to place this right inside my sorting machine room so my so the chunks are always loaded so let's I'll just do that real quick so if I go in here you should see all the items getting sorted nice and I'll place that there do see everything's coming in pretty quickly all that look at that all that cobblestone is just from no that's not just from right now that was from my like quarry before because yeah probably want to speed this up a bit because I can let's do that the fastest possible is just sending them like crazy and they all should be filling up this chest and none of them should be falling on the ground. What's in here? Yep, they all should be filling up in this chest. And that works nicely. So in the future, I'll add some more... What do you, what you want to call it? Some more sorting options. And possibly a few more sorters just for all my items to be sorted. And... That's pretty much it. Thank you all for watching. This has been episode 12. Let's see how fast it's empty. Nope, I don't think that's. I think that's too fast actually. So I'll just go do that. One second. Seems good. And everything is going to be working just fine. So this has been Jordan X. Thank you all for watching. This has been episode 12. And see you all next time. Thanks for watching. Bye bye.